The Oscar nominations were announced today, and diversity was clearly on people's minds. Regina King was nominated for Best Supporting Actress. Well deserved. <laughs> and this was amazing to me. Spike Lee got his first nomination for Best <laughs> Director. And it's crazy. It's crazy that it took that long for him to be recognized after he spent years directing the Indiana Pacers to go f themselves. <laughs> but this year, this year is different. I mean, it's gotten so black that two of the Best Picture nominees had the word black in them. Yeah, it's like Academy voters were like, okay, we don't want another Oscar so white. Uh, black Panther, uh, Black Klansman, you know, screw it. Let's nominate Black Mirror too. Put Black Mirror in there. <laughs> it's a TV show, I don't care. We're playing it safe. So here to talk about the rest of the nominations is someone who was in one of the year's biggest movies, Crazy Rich Asians, our very own <laughs> Ronnie Chang, everybody. Thank you. Thank you. Ronnie. <laughs> it's always an exciting day when the Oscar nominations come out. It's a wide open field. Who do you think is gonna take home Best Picture? Trevor, who gives a shit about Best Picture, all right? <laughs> the story this year is all about the deserving nominees who are snubbed. Snubs, snubs, and more snubs. Especially in the only category that anyone actually cares about. Best Supporting Actor. For performance by an actor in a supporting role. Mahershala Ali in Green Book. Adam Driver in Black Klansman. Sam Elliott in A Star Is Born. Richard E. Grant in Can You Ever Forgive Me? And Sam Rockwell in Vice. Oh, wow, great job, Academy. Solid group of nominees. But maybe you're snubbing someone? Someone like, I don't know, me, Ronnie Chang? <laughs> supporting actor in Crazy Rich Asians, available on iTunes and airplanes everywhere? Wait. <laughs> Wait, right, you, you genuinely think you've been snubbed? I think I've been, yeah, of course I've been snubbed. I lost, a I lost a bunch of no-name uh, hacks. Oh, come on, Ronnie. Those are great actors in this category. Sam Elliott was amazing in A Star Is Born. Sam Elliott. Listen, Trevor, everyone in the business knows his mustache is doing all the acting, okay? <laughs> I could have grown a mustache like that, but I care too much about the craft to rely on cheap facial props like that, okay? Also, my lip can't do that. Okay, well, <laughs> okay, well fine. What, what about Adam Driver in Black Klansman? Uh, pff, you mean emo Darth Vader who brought whining to a galaxy far, far away? Big deal, he played a Jewish guy pretending to be in the KKK. I was playing a Chinese person from Hong Kong when I'm really a Chinese person from Malaysia, okay? That's range. <laughs> Plus, in the movie, I had to play an asshole, when in reality, I'm more of a dick, okay? And understanding <laughs> that subtle difference is what separates the best supporting men from the best supporting boys, okay? And what about Mahershala Ali, huh? He just sat in the car for two hours. I do that every time I take an Uber. All I get is two stars. <laughs> and don't get me started on Richard E. Grant. I bet you're like, who's that, right, Trevor? No, actually, we know him. He's the veteran actor. He's a character actor. He's been in movies for decades. Okay, what? Shut up, Trevor. All right, you know what? <laughs> I should nominate you for least supportive friend. <laughs> Besides, this guy's movie only made $8 million. I know Instagram stories that made more money, all right? <laughs> last and certainly the least, Sam Rockwell in Vice, again. He already won last year. Are we, going to, are we just gonna keep nominating him? Is this the Best Supporting Actor Award or the Best Sam Rockwell Award? Plus, there's already another Sam nominated, okay? Too many Sams. Hashtag Oscar so Sams. Wow, 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 Ronnie. <laughs> you, you really seem angry about this, man. Oh yeah, well, guess what, Trevor? I'm, I'm actually not angry. That was, that was all just acting. Dude, you, I, I'm not gonna lie, you actually had us going. Uh, yeah, thank you. And uh, I hope the Academy will uh, consider this episode for next year's Oscars. Well, <laughs> we're on TV, so it's not uh, eligible for those awards. God damn it, will the snubs never end? Ronnie Chang, everybody!